Hello and welcome back to me playing a little Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous. When last we left off, we just beat a whole bunch of cultists. And now I can kind of wander around and see what's here. Let's see. I believe all these doors are actually locked. What's this? Massively damaged, impassable. Locked. Alright. We'll uh, go this way. And actually, we'll level up our characters. Let's see. Uh, Paladin level 3. Uh, let's see here. Uh, how many points do I get? I get one. Ten is not a bad persuasion. I could start putting points in here. Because that'll be important as well. Alright, let's see here. Um... AC granted by the selected armor is increased. Uh, what feats do I currently have? Let's see, land hands. What did I choose? Oh wait, right here. Uh, weapon focus longsword. Hit what my uh, what is her stats? All right, well let's find something extra mercy. I like mercies. Mercies are actually really good. Uh, you're able to leap from the hiding. Oh, improved initiative because yes. <laughs> Improved initiative is always great. Single attack at your foe within reach. If you hit, you deal normal damage and can make an additional attack. Ah, wait, yes. Um, shake it off. Toughness is actually a really good one as well. Who was it recommended? Wow, it doesn't actually have a recommended for me. <laughs> That's uh, impressive. Power tech's not a bad one to have. Uh, I have to be at uh, work for that. It doesn't say what that requires. Alright, we'll take that. Alright, mercy. Prerequisite for... Um, yeah, let's do that. Uh, oh, good. I was contemplating combat reflexes, but I only have a 12 dex, so... That's not so great. Um, Paladin. Sure. Sure. They kind of auto-do their thing. Oh, wait, what? Uh, actually, I want you to have that, and I want you, Knowledge World. Uh, point blank shop. Wait, who is this? 
Now, this is her. Why would she need point blank shot? She's melee. Uh, we're going to do that. See, he would need point blank shot if he didn't already get that automatically. Oh, but he has deadly aim. Oh, that's such a good ability. It's uh, basically power attack, but for bows. Oh, and he gets a uh, free weapon focus. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right, so good, good. Cool. Uh, let's see here. There, okay. Uh, so we want to go to spellbook. You don't have spells, you don't have spells, you have spells. Alright, uh, level one spells. What's this? Cure light wounds. She has cure light wounds? And she has enlarged person? Wow, that's pretty impressive actually. Um, let's see here. I believe this one could go in there. And. Uh, she's melee, so we'll go with that and that. And. Uh, resist energy is always a good one. Yeah, Resistance Energy is actually one of the best spells. It's just so good. Because you just... Anytime you take uh, elemental damage of whatever type you put on... So, say I put Resistance Energy Fire. You just remove 5 fire damage. Which means that you can literally take 0 damage. All these doors are actually locked, so yeah. Alright, we've leveled up, let's save it. And up we go. I don't think we can go backwards now. <laughs> I was planning on playing Kingmaker, Pathfinder Kingmaker, until I got to the very depressed uh, cleric. But I was thinking, eh. What's this? Do we have guests? <laughs> Just in time. The place is a bit of a mess, and I haven't even poured the blood into the goblets yet. Why don't you... Oh! What an unexpected surprise! Staunton, my little sweetheart. Long time no see. I've missed you so much. Have you missed me? Admit it. You missed me terribly. Um uh, where are you? You again, you wench Here uh... Minago, the one who Be careful. She's one of the deadliest creatures in the whole demon horde. She was once responsible for a massacre in Canabras. She must be back to finish what she started. Does he know me? Staunton, darling. Tell them all how close we were. Um, yeah. That wench? She's the one who led me astray. She's the reason my life has gone to the abyss. She's the reason my dressing fell. Basically, she seduced him, and, uh, and he, uh, 
he told her state secrets. Oh my, like butter wouldn't melt. What I remember is how eagerly you would run to our trysts, how you begged to see me again, how you promised you'd do anything I asked. By your own free will, you said this. And now you claim that Dresden fell because of me. No, no, my dear. That was entirely your own doing. I'll beat your lying lips into your filthy throat! <sighs> now, Staunton, don't say things like that. Not about these lips, the ones you kissed so sweetly. Staunton, dearest, don't you love me anymore? Remember how good we were together? I was so hoping that we could patch things up. I'll kill you! Do not be and into the fight we go. All right, uh, let's see here. Who do we have? A cultist, a sharpshooter, a sharpshooter, wizard. Let's see here. Ooh, saving throw failed. Nice. Not bad. We can charge into combat. And you can charge into combat too. Staunton. I think he's a fighter, isn't he? Oh no, he's a paladin still, okay. He was probably redeemed at some point. Alright, so... You've crossed the wrong mongrel! Oh man, those things just sunder armor. Oh no. I should have killed him first. I can correct that mistake right now. Oh, he's. That's Staunton being attacked. I'm not so concerned with him. They're level five and six, right? Yeah, he's level six, so he gets two attacks. That's unfair. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna shoot you twice. Survive me. <laughs> uh, let's. The spirits demand your blood. We shall overcome. Into the fray. Ow. You just really want to sunder armor, don't you? Yep. Alright. Let's see. Take, uh, collect that. Collect that. Leave the chain shirt. Leave the leather armor. Dagger. Heavy crossbow. Collect whatever that is.
All right, um, that's it. Oh no, mobility. Alright, this is basically where the tutorial section kind of ends. As soon as you step into the chamber, your vision seems to darken and your knees buckle. You struggle to keep your balance. The air in, this, in here is laden with the power coming from the stone. Suddenly your head is filled with voices. Screaming, whispering, cackling, threatening voices, pleading for help, shrieking curses and taunts. You blink and the illusion passes. Congratulations. You made it all the way here. Precious ward stone. Well, what are you planning to do now, hmm? I could kill you where you stand, but wouldn't it be nice if you could die in battle like heroes? No. I want you to die in despair, scrabbling around like rats in the blighted ruins of your city, blind and broken, your flesh scabbed and seeping, and every moment knowing precisely what was done to you sounds terrifying except that's how we've been living for generations there isn't a soul that can resist the temptations of the abyss even a stone can be turned I'm not joking your precious ward stone weakened from the injury inflicted by Discari, has almost succumbed to my charms soon behold barrier around the world wound the gift of your useless goddess will be a weapon of the abyss just a little more and boom <laughs> every city with one of these eyesores stuck in the middle of it from Canabras to Nerosian will turn into smoking craters and all the mortals into red sludge beneath our hooves. Um, that's not good for the world. <laughs> so you have a choice, especially you, my pet. Kiss me on my dainty hoof, pledge your loyalty to Baphomet, and when the world falls, its ruin shall be yours. You've already forgotten me. You mortals have awfully short memories, even shorter than your little lives. Staunton, sweetums, don't you want to introduce me to your friends properly? No? Well, I'd better do it myself. I am Minago, Lilitu and faithful servant of Baphomet, Lily and leader too. of his armies. The city is mine now. I'm just starting to settle in. Get things just how I like them. But once I'm finished, I promise you the results will be simply to die for. Lily twos are subversives and hidden horrors, demons who work subtly in their constant quest to destroy and devastate. Lily twos enjoy few uh few things more than leading mortals into sinful acts. I mean, it sounds like you're run-of-the-mill demon to me, but uh, she's not quite as cool as a succubus, and not quite as fighty as a uh, as a um, oh, what's the one that looks like an angel? Um, uh, I forget what they're called. Um, I'm guessing she's less uh, sexual than a succubus. She's basically a succubus, but less sexual. And it was such a charming little place until you sullied it with your presence. It had such lovely boulevards, quiet and shaded. You took those away from me, and I shan't forgive you for that. Hmm. They've done much worse things than spoil the promenade. All the people they've killed. 
Yes, yes, of course, you're right. I grieve for the common folk as well. If you can't tell, she's actually an evil character. Um, that's why she's got a, a necklace of uh, undetectable alignment. Uh, yeah, don't show this again. I don't care. Hmm. You feel a righteous fury swell within you. How dare this demon besmirch the ground of this beautiful world with her hooves. A world created by the gods and cultivated by mortals. And these cultists, how dare they betray all that sacred, uh, that is sacred and world to join forces with phallus evil. Can they repent and redeem themselves or have they followed the path of evil past the point of no return? The wardstone seems to sense your thoughts. The chamber glows brightly. Uh, echoing the holy flame erupting from your hand, the light also uh, gets brighter and brighter until it floods the chamber. You hear voices stronger now than they repeat your words like a choir of angels. Hey, no eyes. Didn't you tell us that heaven had turned its back on us and no one would come to our aid? I'm done with this shit. I only followed this hoofed menace because I thought the Crusaders had had it. And there was no other way to protect my family. But now I see that there is hope. I won't bow before these heinous idols ever again. If they kill me, at least I'll die a decent death. Yes! Return to our side, friends! Have courage! We will welcome you back. And heaven never abandoned you, no matter what this deceiver told you. Turncoat. I'll cut out your heart. We'll see how tough you really are. We'll let you frighten us once, but it won't happen again. Defeat is not an option. Uh, let's see here. Can we charge? No. Can we charge? No. Okay. Uh, smite evil. You. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, so we're gonna attack you. Nice. Okay. And we're also going to smite evil. And uh, we're gonna run up here. Oh. Uh, let's see here. So we're going to do this. And we're going to do AC. You. Uh, she succeeded. I figured. Hold on. Where is she? She is. She just had her turn. Yeah. Um. She's 28. She's level 28. Although she doesn't actually have a lot of hit points. I'm a little shocked at that. That's only 320. Oh, good for you, sir. Alright, so Sila's down, but she's actually... Uh, this... Uh, this fight is meant to be a loss. Ooh. 
All right. Do I get to loot anything from these guys? Nope. Uh, let's attack you. Okay, hang on. All right. So we're gonna grab this. Uh, grab that. Grab this. Grab that. Grab this. Grab that. Uh, grab this. Grab that. All right, and we're done. So the entire point was for my character to lose all my hit points. The demoness whispers a spell and waves of darkness sweeps through the chamber. Your companions wince in pain, but is nothing compared to what you feel. Thousands of voices once again burst into your mind, drowning you in moans, screams, and sobs. Pain rocks through your skull. Your evil spells won't work. Won't stop a righteous army. Yeah, we're supposed to lose that fight, so it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It'll be good. And this is officially the base of operations now. We're in a tavern. Praise Iomade, you woke up. Healing your wounds was easy, but you were unconscious for so long, I was starting to worry we'd lost you. We couldn't stand up to the demoness. Her spells were too strong. <sighs> it's all right. We'll handle it somehow. You blacked out, but Staunton and I managed to get you here to the Defender's Heart. It used to be a tavern, but now it's our headquarters. We're gathering our forces here, and we're preparing to strike back. Demons have been filling Canabras with their spies and infiltrators for a long time. Unfortunately, I don't have enough people to attack the place right now, at least not blindly. I'd be grateful if you snuck in there and scouted out the situation. But just scouting. Don't be a hero. Yeah, depending on the level, I could probably take it. Bad, but not hopeless. We're constantly getting news, and new sources of resistance keep springing up in the districts where everyone seemed to be dead. The survivors are gathering here. You should see them. Their faces, their eyes burning with determination. The city is destroyed. But our resistance is not broken. We will keep fighting. See, I kind of want them to do this, but with the... Um, so, in... Um, Paizo made... Um, so these are uh, uh, campaign scenarios. They're typically six books long each. Like six sections, six uh, adventures, but they're all connected. Leading you from level one to anywhere from about 15 to... Uh, about 17 or 18 somewhere in there uh depending on how well you do um there are a set of them the very first one they uh released was rat no was um oh what is it called it's uh rune rise of the rune lords rise of the rune lords and then they made a couple of other ones um, later, not directly after that one, but they were in a vague way connected. They actually make mention of the heroes that you played in in uh, Rise of the Runemakers in another one. And I want to say in, and then there was another sequel to that. There was like three sequels along the same line. I kind of want them to do that for, you know, make three games based off of those three things. You heard what the demon said. 
They're going to desecrate the ward stone and blow up the whole barrier around the world wound. That would be an even worse disaster than the world wound's expansion before the Second Crusade. Not only Canabras, but every city with the ward stone will be destroyed, including the capital. We can't allow that no matter what. We will retake it, even destroy it if we must. Iomade's gift must not become a weapon of the Abyss. I mean, we kind of know what the words do. Ward stones do. are a gift of Iomade, created personally by her herald, a mighty angel, and a general of the Celestial Armies. The Ward Stones keep the World Wound from expanding. They stand along the border of the territory controlled by the demons, creating a barrier to keep them inside. The Canabras Obelisk was the first to be placed. It is the key to the whole barrier. We cannot leave it in the hands of those monsters from the Abyss. First of all, we need to decide what to do with the stone once we get a bit. What I'm about to say is classified. A traveler came to the city recently. A blind elf calling himself the Storyteller. He insisted he be allowed to examine the ward stone. He's important. He the alarm when his study was finished. Even before the demon attack, he had found some damage or flaw in the stone. So he's actually in Kingmaker as well. He's not just in this one. He basically is a, uh, he's a storyteller. He literally goes around collecting stories and basically memorizing stories and things like that. He is, even for an elf, he is old, like older beyond belief. Um, we'll, f we'll meet him in a little bit, but he is just that. I don't remember... I don't remember exactly what's with what's his deal exactly, but I know he wanders around collecting stories and he's just super old. Like immortal old. Like he just cannot die. He still ages, but he cannot die. Prelate Hulrune dismissed his words as nonsense, borderline blasphemy. But between you and me, the prelate's opinion isn't worth much. I think the storyteller knew what he was talking about. We could use his advice right now. If only we knew where he was. <laughs> I remember the storyteller spent a lot of time talking to Skonten, a dwarf from my unit. You saw him during the demon attack. The elf asked him about the history of the Crusades. Maybe the storyteller told Skonten something about where we could find him if anything happened. Right. There's another problem. After the attack, the demons began to gather their forces at the Grey Garrison. It'll be even harder to take them with a head on the salt. But I once heard soldiers talking about a secret entrance to the garrison. The trouble is, I have no idea where to look for it. While you explore the city, please keep your eyes open. In case you find something we can use. And one last thing. The Eagle Watch has lost a lot of soldiers recently. Some were killed, but others simply haven't been seen since the attack. In the chaos that is now Canabras, it's next to impossible to confirm anything for sure. <clears throat> One of the missing fighters is Janna Aldori. A new recruit in the watch. She got along well with Sila, and she often went drinking with her. I honestly thought Sila and Janna had died together. But now Sila's returned with you, and there's no sign of Janna. If you learn anything of her whereabouts when you're out in the city, please report back. May the goddess help you. We're still fighting, which means that Canabra still hasn't fallen. If you come across any groups in the city that can fight, send them here to the Defender's Heart. We'll need every fighter we can muster for the final assault. Yes, one more thing. If you're in the area, check out this address. It's our house. Mine and Anevia's. Well, it was our house. If the building is still standing, Open the hidden compartment in the kitchen. It's filled with supplies for a rainy day. You can take whatever you find. You have more need of it. Okay. She walks away, and now we're in here. So, personal to... Ooh, what the heck is all this stuff? Uh, so, this is stuff that I've gotten from um, just various... Uh, Expansions and DLCs that I've uh, bought. 
All right, so let's see here. We'll inspect that in a minute. Camilla, Crusader. Oh, wait. I gotta get. Hey, wait. Mind if I bend your ear on something? Oh, hey, it's Anivia. So, here's the first and most important thing. Beth gave you a crucial mission. I get that. And I know you'll get the job done. I saw you in action. But here's the rub. Here's the rub. By sending you out on an errand, we're weakening our defenses here. If they come at us while we're gone, I don't know if we'll be able to find them off. Uh, so the rift that damn beetle left with its scythe, yeah, well, it cut the city into two. And it's kind of difficult to get across. My scouts tell me that there's a half-decent place to set up a crossing in Market Square, not... Uh, any of them tried to make it uh, to make sure but if you've got a mind to cross it I think you're gonna have to eventually uh, you might want to give the square once over what no uh, your task is far too important you can't just hole up here all cozy like waiting for the demons to knock on your door we need to take the fight to them but if those freaks try to make a move on this place Beth will send a runner to get you if that happens you leg it back here alright because if you don't they'll you'll be coming back to an ash pile got it uh, uh your guess is as good as mine it might not be here not be here they could attack the whole damn city uh, they actually do attack this place um, it's a kind of a fun fight uh, thank you for the warning. Anyway, yeah. Uh, so let's see. Need to talk to him. 1,000 gold coins for you, just as promised. You helped me back to the surface, and I duly paid you for escorting. Horgus, Horgus Worm always keeps his word. Now, speaking of our future cooperation, I have a job that would be perfect for someone like you. Naturally, I'll pay generously for your services. What do you mean, job for someone like me? For an adventurer ready to sell their soul for booze, then lie down drunk in the gutter. Or do you think you're somehow different? A traveling knight, perhaps? A noble heart? But without coin to your name? You seem a reliable enough ally to me. And you did get me out of the, those mongrel caves. So why should I care what you do with my money once you've got it? Uh, Horger seems like one of those people who think the entire world owes them. However, you hear notes of hysteria beneath this smug arrogance. It's as though he's really quite nervous, but... Taking great pains to conceal it. Oh, really? How impudent. No one dares to tell Horgus how to... Uh, how... how Tell Horgus Gorm how to address the rabble. You shall be my bodyguard. You see, I have good reason to return to my mansion here in Canabras. I still have, well, it doesn't matter. It's none of your business. My mansion is breathtaking building with a large garden in a wealthy part of the city. Even before the demons attacked, every thief and fraudster in the city had tried to get inside one way or the other. I shudder to imagine the state it's in now. I have little hope that my guards are able to hold the mansion during the attack. And I expect the servants fled when they saw the demons. Only Ab Abadar knows what's happened there since. Therefore, I would ask that you meet me at my mansion and guard me, and, uh, guard me there until I complete my business. I already asked the local paladins to help but they're no desire to set foot outside this tavern. Damn cowards and traitors. That's what they are. Also, please, do not take Camilla, uh, Camilla with you. I trust that girl more than... Oh, please, do take her. I trust that girl more than the rest of your gang. 
She is of noble birth, after all. Um, 15 or better. Ooh. Deal. Marvelous. Most excellent. I'll proceed to my mansion at once and wait you wait for you there. Meanwhile, you needn't worry. I know the city like the back of my hand. But do not hur but do hurry unless you want me to lower your reward. Alright. Oh, uh are you Yeah, show me what you have. Okay, so let's sell things. Uh, yeah, okay. Masterwork, masterwork. Uh, I tend to keep all the, um, what's this one? Oh, composite. I don't really need to composite longbows. I tend to keep all the magic items, but I will sell basically everything else oh. I'm gonna keep that in case I need it for something uh, dueling sword short sword uh, I don't really need ever burning torches oh wait a second yeah, we'll take him back. That's fine. Um, all right. Uh, deal. Let's see, what does he have? Um, bag of holding. Yes. <laughs> Dark omen. What's this thing do? Uh, if the wearer can cast spells spontaneously, uh, that would be uh, a lot of mas magic classes like, um, Sorcerers, uh, bards, oracles. Oracles are another one. Um, not sure what else can. I'd have to look at the other classes, but they're pretty easy to tell if you look at them. Uh, we don't care. <gasps> oh, nope, want that. Apprentice lockpick. Don't care, don't care, don't care, and I'm down to my stuff. All right, uh, deal. Uh, bulk selling. Okay, so basically this uh, gets rid of all items that are just, you know, garbage items that can be sold. Wait, what? Isn't it a cooking item? Hang on, hang on. Where's the fish? Fish. Oh, this is a cooking ingredient. Oh, okay. Ah, I thought the honey was actually a cooking ingredient, but apparently not. Alright, so this stuff, yeah, it's just... Item, interest. A merchant would pay well for it, yeah. Not really well, but... Alright, uh, let's see here. Oh, uh, yes. Uh, so we go like this. I. Uh, yeah, go away. Ah, there it is. Uh, copy recipe. Alright. Uh, let's see. Okay, so what's in the chest? Uh, so we're gonna move that in there. We're gonna put that in there just in case. I tend to keep a lot of just random things. Oops. Let me keep that on me. Alright. You guys. You guys. Alright. Uh, 
Okay. So go like this. Okay. And a hat. Uh, summons a tiny dragon. Don't mind if I do. Summons a tiny little elf cat. Uh, boots. Gloves. Uh, oh man. Um. Oh, did I? Okay. Sort. Uh, weight, uh, descending. Weight and descending. Okay. Uh, show me what you have. Oh, yeah, I forgot that. All right. So I should have identified all this stuff. Uh, this hat grants five max hit points. <laughs> Damage rolls on swarms. Okay, cool. Uh, what's this thing do? Um, persuasion checks. Honestly, that's actually really good. Um, Camilla, I'm going to give this to you. Nope, you have that. Uh, you get that then. Okay. Alright, what else did I grab? I grabbed these. Um, attack rolls in addition... Uh, they grant a plus two bonus on damage rolls when mounted. Oh, it'd be nice if I was a cavalier. Uh, on saving throws against movement impairing conditions. Okay. And, oh, what were these bracers? Uh, look bonus on reflex. Only your main character can uh, equip those. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, you're actually going to get these. And that's it. Okay. Let's see. He's a crusader. Is there a pathfinder dude around here? Kayato. Converse crusader. Pink eye. No, no. There's Sila. And I thought there was a pathfi uh, Pathfinder dude around here somewhere. Who are you? Um. Are you one of the Crusaders? Thank you for defending those of the town Slyoff. Uh, servant of Aristotle, pleased to meet you. Uh, what are you? I took my holy orders. Da, 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 da. Faith. Are you f I could use a cleric. My spells are depleted. I have no training in potions or scrolls. See this robe? I'm cutting for bandages. It's the second to last one. Uh, Chili Creek. Continue. Cool. Alright, I have to go. Okay. Hmm. I don't think. Oh, uh, actually, hold on. Belt. And you too. Uh, so this will grant a plus one wisdom for a bunch of knowledge checks, and this grants a plus one, plus two morale bonus on perception and lore nature. Oh, oh, wait, oh no, they're both that. They don't stack. Okay, I'm gonna call it here for an episode. Uh, we made it to the end, and yeah i'll see i'll look up where the pathfinder is i thought he was in this tavern but i could be wrong uh we'll look it up and see because then i can 
uh, create my own characters to have them a party. But yeah, we'll call it here for that episode. Uh, thank you all for joining me on this journey. You can take a look down in the description for a link to the Free Time Creators Collective Discord. It's where a bunch of us hang out and kind of have some fun and talk and things like that. Uh, you can also find links to everybody's channels. People like Big Baby J, I'm Not Great, K-Dog's Kennel, Holly's Adventure, Stubbs the Wizard, Plumberry Delicious, and many others. Uh, they all play games. They don't play games like this, but they do play games. Uh, they would love to have you stop by and say hello. But until next time, do stay safe out there. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye now.